Hello everybody, it's Andrea, welcome back to the channel. It is time for my completed pages from June, I think I did 22 or something along those, in various colouring books. Yes, so, if you've never been here before, welcome, I hope you enjoy this video and I hope you'll subscribe. And if you're already a subscriber, thank you very much, I really do appreciate you coming back and enjoying these videos. No haul against this month. There will be a haul at the end of the ju July, I guarantee it. <laughs> I'll explain why when I do the haul. So let's have a look. So we'll start with our colour by number pages. So I did one in Magical Artifacts Colour by Number for Adults by Sachin Sach Diva. Now again, this is, I used some new pens for this. Now I haven't hauled these pens yet, uh, but they are the Deco Time water-based markers. And they're really nice. So, that and I just love doing these they don't take too long and it's just nice and easy for me to just chill out and relax while doing them and I've got one in pretty flowers ceramic tiles color by number this is Prachi Dewan such diva and I think this is the first one I've done in this because it's a new book and I've only just got it not long ago I think I hauled it I did haul it um yeah so I did the daisy and they're so easy to do. I'll probably do a couple more in that one. Same markers as the other one. I did another one in 100 Best Adult Cover by Numbers by Sun Life Drawing. I do, I, mean, I like this book. And I did this little elfy fairy type person. Um, I do like this book and I'm, I'll be doing more in this one as well. Just because again, although these are a bit more detailed because so much in them. I think those were the Amazon pens, but I'm not sure. I, I've lost the plot on what I use these days because unless it's pencils, I haven't got a clue. Right, okay, now onto the pictures. I did one in Retro Deco by Carla Magana. And this was a buddy colour with Chelsea over at Chelsea's Creative Escapes or whatever it's called. I can never remember, sorry, Chelsea. And again, this is done with various uh, glitter markers and some, uh, these are the Winsor & Newton Brights. Yeah, just a mishmash of markers. Very 80s looking, I thought. Very Madonna in the 80s, I thought. And uh, yeah, I like it. I really, really, I really enjoy these. Uh, and this was the, I'm gonna say the Artix Metallics, silver and gold, I think. I have got a few Jade Summer books here now because, um, yeah, I've, at the start of the month I had a load of books I haven't coloured in of Jade Summer. I am now down to five I haven't coloured in and two whips which are downstairs and I'll be finishing this month. But I did do the following in the Jade Summer books that I hadn't coloured in. So I did one in Steampunk and it was uh, this one and when I photographed this and put this up on Instagram, it looked like it was very 3D. <laughs> it does. And this was done with various markers and some uh, metallic pens as well. I'm going to knock my coke off the side in a minute if I'm not careful. Please excuse me. Um, I did one in the Fantasy Kids uh, Jade Summer book. Again, this is one I had never coloured in before. And I did this one, and I really like doing this one. Again, various markers. Can't remember which, really. I think I used the mix mash that are downstairs. But, uh, yeah, I really enjoyed that. It's good fun. I, I like the Jade Summer books. Um, and I did one in the Dinosaurs colouring book well it's a kids colouring book but I just, I just think they're so cute and let me find it I did this one and this one was done with a mixture of Arteza pens and the touch five markers I bought years ago that still work some of them still work some of them don't <clears throat> uh, but yeah so he's really cute so I did that one and this one was really sweet and it didn't take too long um, yeah then I got Princess Colouring Book, Jade Summer. Again, this is one I've had for a while and didn't colour in. I don't know why. And I actually did the cover page. 
Um, and again, I did it with a diff uh, uh, the various markers, um, Arteza mainly, and the Touch News, and some of my glitter gel pens, the uh, Link Shine ones, just to give it a bit of glitter. But yeah, I just really, really liked that picture, and I, I think it looks really good. So yeah. Yeah, I really, I really do like that picture, actually. I'm glad I did that one. It looks nice. Now, Jade Summer, <clears throat> after having around a year off, and now back to releasing books. Hooray! Well, the first book they put out this year is Amazing Dogs. Um, so this is, as you can see, it's very zen doodly. This is uh, Alexis, Joyce and Candice Janey. I have done the first one and I did it all neons and really really enjoyed it absolutely enjoyed it took me a while to do but I got the pens I got for Christmas from my secret Santa and I just started with the bright pink on his ears and just filled it in and I think it looks really good so I might do one in just one color you know in different shades of one color but i wanted the first one to be really really bright and i really really did enjoy it so excuse me oh there we go so that's that one i like that book that one i haven't hauled yet so i need to put that in my haul uh, spooky sweets by carla magana i did one in that this was a buddy color as well this was a buddy color with mimi on instagram I did this one and as you can see she's very sweet very pink tutu and a little cupcake and this was done with the markers that are downstairs so that are the shuttle arts uh, there are ohuhus and what's the other ones that are down there oh the deco time markers yeah so and, and some glitter pen as well on her tights and various other bits yeah so see what I mean I got so many markers and I just use them and what did you forget Tales from the Witch's, Witch's Cottage this was a buddy colour with Molly Newland and I did this one this one was done in the water based markers that I got the deco time ones now they have gone through slightly to the previous page but I know that I can cover that up without any issues at all apart from maybe this really dark black bit here but I'm not worried too much about that I can sort that out it, it, it's it's fine um, yeah so again it was done with those uh, deco time water based markers which is um, different there is some glitter gel pen on there mostly some silver but that's about it really but yeah, that was fun. I enjoyed that. Um, yeah. Thanks, Molly. Right, now we're on to the 10 books to finish. As you know, I've finished one of those 10 books. Woohoo! And now I'm going to show you how I'm getting on with the rest of them. So we've got one in uh, Stefania Miro's Easy Flower Mandalas. And this one. And this one was just done with various gel pens. Some Link Shine, some just random ones. It's whatever I've got handy when I'm doing it, basically. Um, but yeah, that one's, it's getting closer. I don't know how many of these I'm gonna finish. Not all of them, not many of them. Um, I do believe I will finish this one. There's not many left in this. I actually did a couple in this one. Uh, so I've got this one. <clears throat> Again, this was done with markers that are up here. So I think on this one, this was the Decotime water-based markers that I use, which is fine. Because I was trying them out when I first got them and it, I think that looks fine and I did one of the bonus pages in the back which was this one again that was done using the deco time water base markers as well because she's got this very funny coloured skin and I can't remember which one that was what number was that five it's supposed to be a light brown it's more like a putty colour but I quite like it and I think it looks quite good but that one I will finish. I'll do a full update on these afterwards. Um, and then I've got uh, Chelsea's Pretty Creations. I did one in here. Let me just find it. And 
I did this one, which I do like. It's very cute. Various markers. That was an Artix um, acrylic uh, paint pen. Uh, it has yellowed through there, and I don't know which marker that was. It's it's probably an Arteza brown. I don't know though. <laughs> hand. But it doesn't matter. These doubles, I'm going to, because uh, I, I think that's a double. Yeah. I'm going to give these to Jennifer. So I'll probably do this one and she can have the lighter one. Um, so she gets the one that's not damaged. Yeah, so I'm going to give uh, once there's six pages left in here for me to do. And then when I finish it, Jennifer can do the rest. Uh, Jade Summer 50 Easy Mandalas. I did another one in here. And I did this one. And this was done in red and gold metallics they're downstairs on the coffee table so i did this one downstairs and it was just it was just fun to do i really enjoyed it so yeah there's that one then i've got 50 easy patterns by jade summer looks like i've done two in this one and I know I'm not going to finish this book. Let me just get that one. Thing. And I did this one with some pastel markers and a nice red. I'm not even sure where, which markers they were. Have they gone through or are they? It looks like they are. I've got a feeling they might be the Deco Time ones looking at it. And then this one, which is again done with the metallics. It might not have been, it might have been the Amazon ones. I, no, they go through. I have no idea if that one was done downstairs. But, uh, yeah. So now I'm not going to finish the Jade Summer ones, but it's nice to get a good chunk of stuff done from them. Uh, Calibre Number Flowers. Big one in here. I like this book. It's so easy to do. And I just did this one. And again, this was done downstairs, so it's all the bits of markers. So we've got Shuttle Art, Deco Time, Oh Who Who. I don't know whatever's left downstairs or oh, the office stationery ones united office ones rather or something they called so yeah i just pick the most appropriate color and go for it so looking forward to doing more in that one this month because i do like them then rose windows a creative haven this one i'm pretty sure i think i've got 10 left in here but i'm pretty sure i can finish it because these do oh it smells so nice i smell the pens do look so nice and I literally just used the three colours on here so I used orange, red and yellow and I think it looks really pretty um, and these were the markers from Create Box which is a Liddles um, they are the ones that work best and look really good in this book so I'm hoping I will finish this one I didn't colour in um, Jade Summers Mandala colour by number. I just didn't get round to it. Um, but I did do one or two in here actually, which is the Kawaii colour by number by Colour Questopia. I did this one with the little bees. And I, I do like it. And this was done probably with looking at it as Amazon, the Amazon markers. And I did this one of the little panda bears, and this was done using the Deco Time markers, the water-based ones. And yeah, I like them. Now, I like this book. I am not going to finish this in any way, shape or form this month. There's far too much in it. And 